I'm Nafis Ben Zafar. I'm a principal engineer at DreamWorks Animation, and I specialize in effects and dynamic simulation systems. I won a Technical Academy Award in 2007. All right. Uh, now, last year you were prevented from coming here. Uh, thankfully, you're here now. Uh, so, what are your thoughts about MTD? It's a fantastic program. I have many friends who graduated in this program, and and they're really great engineers, and they're really great artists, and it's always a pleasure to work with them, and I finally got to see where they went to school, and I now put the stories to the real place, so it's, uh, it's been fun being here. And uh, specifically these days, uh, the expo that we've been doing, what do you think about that? It's fantastic for the students, really, to have exposure to companies and to these great speakers that you've had for these two days, and I'm sure it's very inspiring. It would have been very inspiring for me as a student to be here and get all these great ideas for different things to work on. Uh, so what, what, what makes you want to be here? Uh, why are you here, basically? <laughs> you know, it's, uh, it's, again, like I said, I've, I've had so many friends uh, who, who went to school here, and, and I was so very impressed with uh, the work that they did, and, um, and I've benefited from, from a lot of that, those collaborations that I've had with them. And uh, it's in a way, it's a little way that I can give back to this community. All right. Uh, would you tell us a little bit about your work? Uh, tell us, uh, what is your role at uh, DreamWorks? Um, as a principal engineer, I lead a team of artists and engineers. And we work on tough technical challenges that are really new effects for the facility. It's things we've not done before. And it's usually a visual problem. Um, it's not long-term software engineering. We are, we are in the mix between art and uh, the techniques. Uh, so it's, it's tough problems that's beyond the scope of an artist or even a bunch of artists to do. And it, but it still requires a certain amount of artistic skill, so hybrid. All right. Uh what sort of qualities would you say would be helpful if you'd want to apply for a position at DreamWorks? Um, I think uh, the most important thing is to be curious about computer graphics, right? And, and you have to be interested in all areas of, of CG and of filmmaking. Uh, it, it, it doesn't uh, really work to just pick a single thing and then only know about that um, or just be into software engineering or C++. Or, it, it really has to be all-encompassing, and I think that's really what sets computer graphics people apart from um, all the other professions, is because we bring everything together. It's little bits of electrical engineering and software design and graphic arts and um, you know, animation, all these kinds of, of skills that are brought together in our field. Uh, you have worked on movies such as Pirates of the Caribbean, uh, 2012, uh, The Croods, uh, just to mention a few. Uh, can you describe the work environment for productions on such a large scale? It's a very creative, high-energy work environment. Lots of people bring in tons of great ideas. We try lots of things that don't end up on the screen. Uh, that's one of the most amazing things, I think, is uh, we get to see a lot of evolution of ideas from movie to movie. Uh, and we bring our previous experiences and knowledge of what worked in the past to that. Um, and with that, the knowledge of what didn't work quite as well, so we have new things to work on. So every movie that we make is better than the last movie that we made, and uh, that enthusiasm is, is very palpable. And uh, what has been most fun uh, working with, and what are you most proud of? <laughs> um, you know, every, like, like I was saying, every day is, is a new adventure. It's a new problem to work on. And, and computer graphics and filmmaking is very gratifying that way. Is um, we have not run out of of new things to to work on, things to improve. Nothing is done. Um, so I think uh, I'm just happy happy that I get to work in this field. And um, yeah. Okay. Uh, lastly, uh, how will you spend your remaining time here in Sweden? <laughs> I'm going to be eating a lot of fantastic bread and drinking a lot of amazingly strong coffee, um, both of which I, I didn't really appreciate enough until I got here. Uh, and it's, uh, it's beautiful. It's much colder here than in California, uh, but uh, it's, uh, it's very nice. So I'll be enjoying the sights. Sounds great. Uh, thank you so much. Thank you very much.